Package file is the preferred format when providing files to Bellmark. Before packaging, there are a couple elements that will help expedite your files through the Bellmark process. First would be to have the cut portion of your die set to a die line swatch. Next would be to make sure that all of your images are linked within your Illustrator file and not embedded. An embedded image will have this symbol next to the image on the links panel. Go ahead and relink to your native file. At this point, we can save the AI file. Select File, Save As, Make sure that create PDF compatible file and include linked files are selected. Go ahead and select OK. Now that we verified everything is OK, we are ready to package our file. Select File, Package. I recommend using your desktop as a location as this will be a duplicate file and does not overwrite your original file. I normally don't rename the folder. What is very important is to make sure all five boxes are selected and checked. When you are, you are ready, you can select Package. If this is your first time packaging a file, you might get a prompt about sharing fonts. It states that it is okay for Bellmark to have a copy of the font for processing the art. Go ahead and select OK. After Illustrator finished creating the package files, it will prompt if you wish to view the files. You can select Show Package. When you are viewing the files, you will see an AI file along with any fonts and links that are used within the file. If everything looks good, you can go ahead and right click and compress it to a zip folder. This zipped file is what should be sent to Bellmark. For more how-to videos and to stay up to date with Bellmark News, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube page to receive updates from the source library and follow our social media pages linked down below in the description.